UTSA football held its ninth annual Fiesta Spring game today at Dub Ferris Stadium. Quarterback Frank Harris, who's coming back from an ACL injury, looked good as he fights for QB1. The Clemens grad rushed for 47 yards, including his longest right there of 42 yards, and he passed for 66 more. Second quarter, Cordell Grundy lobs a nice pass to Tariq Woolen for a sweet touchdown grab to put Team Wine on top, 10 to nothing, and White beats Blue, 20 to 7. Our Jake Kaberski has more. Thanks, Larry. A lot of positive takeaways today from the UTSA spring game. And one of the things head coach Frank Wilson emphasized prior to spring was increased physicality from his football team. Well, we saw plenty of that on display today. And we also saw the return of quarterback Frank Harris as he continues to battle back from injury. I was like a little kid out there, uh, cherishing every moment because I know he could be taken away at any minute. And uh, I feel like it was a lot physical. I know you've seen some hits out there. Uh, they weren't backing down for nobody, not even the quarterbacks, which is good. So I know we'll be ready for, for season. I think he showed the elusiveness. Uh, the escapability, the ability to extend a play uh, in the run game, in the pass game. He's just, he's never down, you know, and we're, you know, I kind of give it a quick whistle sometimes just because I don't want him uh, to be in a compromised position. Uh, I thought he did a good job today, though. It was just a great day. We were clicking on all cylinders in the beginning. We just kept going. We was pounding the ball, pounding the ball, and that's to set up the pass plays. You know, we all worked together and helped each other today. Countdown now begins to the Roadrunners season opener August 31st at the Alamo Dome against in-city rival Incarnate Word. With the Roadrunners, Jacob Ersky, KSAT 12 Sports.